Let's stay on the diamond as we go from baseball to softball. As Jeremy Kruk, the captain of Crushing It Softball, is here right now. And Jeremy, thanks for joining us. Talk about your team a little bit. The team name itself, where did that come from? I'm crushing it. Uh, it's a Brad Paisley song. So uh, the team uh, travels a lot, plays a lot of uh, country music, uh, blasting at the thing. And uh, when we sat down and named it, it fit with softball. So we went with crushing it. You end up talking about how you have to travel a lot. So um, how many tournaments do you play and where do you have to travel to? Our tournament team plays approximately 20 to 25 uh, in a given summer. Uh, and we travel anywhere uh, as north as like lacrosse area. You know, we'll go down south to, you know, Monticello, uh, Montello. We'll kind of go all over. I go all the way to Avoca and then we've made uh, trips kind of over in the Milwaukee area. So we play all over the place. Excellent. So now a team like that, of course, always looking for sponsors. Who sponsors you guys? And exactly what does a sponsor do for you guys? Sure. Crushing has got three sponsors. Uh, Red Mouse is our primary sponsor. Uh, it's a the bar and grill out in the you know west side of Madison. Uh, then we also have a construction company, Crook Brothers uh, Construction uh, and Painting Company sponsors us. And we're also sponsored by Two Gingers Irish Whiskey. Uh, oh, nice. <laughs> a sponsor, a sponsor really, uh, they pay for us uh, to, you know, some of the little things for us like tents and, you know, and speakers and, you know, things like that. They also pay for our entry into all the tournaments that we play in and a given year. Two gingers. Okay. I kind of like that mm -hmm. name too. <laughs> so what, what nights a week does Red Mouse run softball leagues? Uh, the Red Mouse is running a co-ed league Monday nights. Uh, they're still looking for some teams. Uh, they also run a men's league on Thursday nights and a men's league on Wednesday nights as well. Okay, so now how many tournaments are you running over there, uh, or is the Red Mouse running, and then when are they? Uh, the Red Mouse runs about four tournaments uh, in a given year, and they're uh, from competitive to rec, uh, and they have co-ed as well. I know they run four, and the first one is starting uh, April 22nd as a men's tournament. Okay, very good. And so now let's talk about, like, your team specifically. How long has your team been together, and then how long have you been playing softball personally? Oh, we're a new team. Uh, this is technically our first year under Crushing It. Uh, we kind of assembled halfway through last year and I uh, played in a couple tournaments and this year we actually officially got together and uh, are running a full season. Uh, I've been playing since uh, you know, since college really. I never played baseball in high school or any of that kind of stuff so I've been playing since about college so 10 years or so. Okay, so now how competitive are these games? Because a lot of people think, okay, softball, and it's just a lot of beer drinking. Is there that, or, or are we going pretty competitive uh, here? Uh, our team, there's a lot of beer drinking. Excellent. Um, it, it, is, it is a very, <laughs> very competitive. Yeah. <laughs> very, very competitive. Uh, there is rec teams, and there are competitive teams, and there's kind of a mix of everything. So uh, it depends on what level you're at. There's quite a bit to, uh, to do. So. Very cool. Jeremy, good luck on a, a good season for you. And thanks for joining us. We'll be back with more right here on the Sports News on Channel 57 Sports.